honestly, I'm only buying this pack. Push it to the limit with the red line bundle. It's just called red line. I'm only buying this pack because Sergeant Squeaky Weapon Charm. <laughs> So yeah, I don't even care about the guns. I don't care about the sticker that says Danger Duck. I only care of the Sergeant Squeaky. If it wasn't named Scar Sergeant Squeaky, I probably wouldn't buy it right now. But I got it. Look, I mean, look at this guy. But anyway, 1,400 cow points. It's a little steep for just two blueprints, a sticker, and a weapon charm. I mean, for 1,000 more cod points, you usually get an operator, tracer pack, finishing move, and some other things. So I mean, it's a little steep. First one is the full spectrum. Clear the air and send waves with the full spectrum SMG. That's how it looks. I like how it looks. I like the color scheme a lot. It's like a matte finish. The second one is called Red Shift. Fortify your position with the Red Shift weapon. I also like how this looks. I love the red color scheme. It's like a, like I said, the matte finish. You get Danger Duck sticker. I don't, I'm not a huge fan of stickers in the game. I didn't really, I like them a little bit in Modern Warfare, but not that much. I don't really use them in this, but that's cool to have, I guess. And, and the charm right here, Sergeant Squeaky. Keep your battle buddy close and your enemies closer. Hell yeah, Sergeant Squeaky. All for 1,400 COD points. They're both legendary blue blueprints. So we're going to have to test them out and say 1,400 COD points, whatever. Who knows? I don't really know if 1,400 COD points is a good amount. I mean, come on. I feel like it should have been 1,000 at most. The full spectrum is for the KSP. Wow, I haven't even used the, the Street Sweeper like to gain progress. I've only ever used it when I bought the first blueprint. And when I first bought the first blueprint, I did this challenge and I never touched it again. So I'm still level one with that. Wow. And the red shift is for the Street Sweeper. Both of them, all the attachments are filled up. So let's look at the attachments. For the KSP full spectrum, you got the Silix Hollow Scout. The muzzle is the Sound Suppressor. The barrel is the 8.9 Extended. The underbarrel is the field agent foregrip and the stock, no stock. And that's how it looks. The barrel and the and the silencer, hella long. That's how it looks with gold. That's how it looks with diamond. There's just one awkward that is just so awkward right in the middle there. And that's how it looks with Damascus. It really kind of goes hard with Damascus with that little like rainbow line right there. That's cool. I'll put the sticker on for the video. We'll put them at number two. And for the street sweeper, red shift. You got the barrel is the 13.3 hammer forge. Body is the SWAT 5MW laser sight. Magazine is a 15 round drum. Handle is speed tape and the stock is this duster stock. That's how it looks with gold. That's how it looks with diamond. And that's how it looks with Damascus. Ah, Damascus. That's how it looks with DM Ultra. I don't know if I said Damascus for the other one before. Oh my god, I didn't even equip Sergeant Ducky. Sergeant Squeaky. My bad. Sergeant Squeaky's going right on the gun. And we'll put Danger Duck there to fit the pack. I gotta go back over here and do it. The whole point I brought the pack. So here's the two guns. Let's hop into a game. Show them off. See if it's even worth it. We got Team this Deathmatch. This person does not leave the fucking room. Okay. First weapon inspect for the KSP. Okay. And then for the Street Sweeper, I really do like the color scheme. I love this, like, matte finish. And it's, like, mad bright. It's got, got like, an orange tint to it. Even though it's, like, red. All right. Definitely. I like the sticker. The sticker's growing on me right there. Especially on the Street Sweeper that's in your face like that. Nope. Oh, I forgot the KSP is a three-round burst. What's up? What's up? Oh, well, that's got the long ass reload time, so I'll be there forever. Damn it! I forgot again! What's up? Got you! Got you! Got you! No! I mean, keep in mind, these are legendary blueprints, so they're supposed to be good, I guess. Which I am actually enjoying both of them. I think they're both good so far. Definitely liking the Street Sweeper a little more. What's up? What's up? What's up? Get out of here. Someone's in here. <laughs> Got you. Someone's down below. Got you, bro. Got you, bro. Bro. Still got the met. Yeah, it's got the long ass reload time. We'll be here for a couple hours. Thank God, victory. Takes so long to reload, you might as well just start a new game. <laughs> oh, where's my name? Where's my name? My name's not even there. Oh, there I am. I didn't go over it before, but that's the stats for the KSP. The speed's upgraded, the accuracy is upgraded, the ammo is upgraded. More definitely of a run and gun type of, you know, some machine guns, considering it's a no stock. And the street sweeper, firepower is increased, speed is increased, accuracy is increased, and ammo is increased, everything is increased. This gun's a beast, that's all I gotta say about it. And Sergeant Squeaky, come on, it's Sergeant Squeaky. You, you knew going into this, Sergeant Squeaky was gonna be OP. I feel like this would have worked really well with a red tracer pack. I mean, the gun is all red. If they could do like some type of tint like that for the tracer pack, that would have worked re really well. 
It definitely would have justified the 1400 COD point tag. No! Goodbye. Oh shit. Alright, you got that. I can't hit that long shot. What? <laughs> that team, my teammate did all the work for that one. It looks so nice. That red just pops. I probably would take off this, uh, this sight. I feel like this would be better without the sight and a lot quicker without the sight. Maybe like some, some other uh, attachment to go for it. Maybe like a bigger mag or a different handle would help make it a lot quicker. So I probably wouldn't run the holographic for it. But I'm not a huge fan of holograph of anything but the iron sights in this game. Oh my god! Yo, what is this guy doing? Oh, there's so many! Got you. The people behind us. <laughs> Definitely liking the Street Sweeper blueprint. A little more than the KSP blueprint. I mean, come on. Come on. Come on. What was that? Get out of here. God! <laughs> What's up? Oh, God. No. I'm gonna try that. Oh. Let's flank it. Come on, peek your head. Got you. Got two. Ah. Uh. All right. I mean, I don't know if I could justify it being 1,400 cop points, but they are both pretty good blueprints. Street Sweeper a little more, I prefer. But that just might be because I think the Street Sweeper is a little OP. I would definitely check out this pack for Sergeant Squeaky. Whole reason I bought it, like I said, can you really put a price tag on Sergeant Squeaky? No, you can't. He's priceless. Anyway, you let me know what you think of this pack, if it's worth it. Let me know what you think of Sergeant Squeaky, because I know he's worth it. Like, comment, subscribe. I will see you all on the next one. Peace.